Hello everyone and welcome to After Hours, a janky little game that I found on Steam and uh, just wanted to try it out and see what it, how it was. Don't know really anything too much about this game, but um, it looked kind of interesting, so here we are. So let's get into it. I'm happy my sister survived the accident. I'm oh. looking forward to seeing her. Well, I hope she's okay. Talk to the nurse. I'm here to visit. Where's her room? Um, room 110. Sure. Okay. I understood every word she said. You know, it kind of reminds me of the of, of watching like Charlie Brown when the you talk to the adults and they're just like. <laughs> Alrighty, I guess I can't go in there. What is wrong with her face? Her face looks kind of, you know, not, not, not a hundred percent. Okay, it looks like we gotta go there. Go. Uh huh. Uh huh. Well, the power of deduction has told me that all these doors are locked you might as well just go here <laughs> uh. is there a janitor in here i mean hello is that nurse is the only one that's working here what's going on man this this is grimy ass room over here. at least they got some coffee there huh? where's my sister and why is this room so dirty no, I why have to get back to the reception to see what's up? Why did that door shut all by itself? <laughs> why does Hold on. Hold on. Let me try some. Did this just change? What happened here? Oh. Everything is so dirty and old. Maybe the exit signs lead back to the reception. I need to find out what's going on. This look... I mean, it went from like a, a normal looking hospital to a rundown version shell of itself where I would think ghost hunters would have like their own little uh, investigation. Um, seems a little bit different than what I remember. I feel like everything just changed. Like, we just teleported into, like, a completely different hotel. Wait, is more supposed to go this way? Follow the exit signs. <laughs> exit. is changed. Why is it so different now? Hello? Yeah, What's that's... going on here? I don't know. I'll just leave again. Yeah. Huh? What's going on? I don't know. The doors are locked, and I can't see anything. There must be a generator in the basement or something that can get the lights going again. Oh, a flashlight. What a coincidence. What a coincidence indeed. And how would he know that there's a flashlight? Nope. Nope, don't want not, none of that. Nope, you don't. I don't want any of that. You all, you can just keep it. That, um, that looks like death. I hear spooky noise. Um, exit, oh, stairs. Here we go. Uh, okay, well, let's just follow the marker and we'll, uh, hopefully we'll get to where we're going. Here. Oh, battery. What? Push me out of the way? What's wrong with you, door? Ah, uh, there's uh, a generator. Yes. Damn it, it's broken. Ah. Uh, Looks like I could put the cables back together with some tape. I'll have to have a look around. You know, I, I think that could be a problem right there. 
Uh, yeah. All right. So look for Tate to repair the generator. We got well, one of eight. Let's looking for tape now. Any tape? Tape. Hello, tape. You know this game kind of reminds me of uh, like a Five Nights at Freddy's type of game, or maybe a little bit like that uh, Granny game where get kidnapped by some crazy old lady and you're like having to escape the house um those mattresses oh okay okay we're so probably gonna be hiding from the psycho nurse of death This is not the place to get freaking lost. So, uh, you know, for being an abandoned hospital, you're finding a lot of batteries just left around. This is like almost better than going to Radio Shack or door for batteries. Nope, don't want anything to do with that. That does not look good. I'm okay. Shower. Okay. If this is your office that you are going to work. <laughs> Let's turn all these on. We'll waste their imaginary electricity that they probably don't have. No, this is the... Here, if, if you're a worker and you're going here to go to work every day, I think you might want to just get a different job because that does not look... Yeah, it's just, it's just no, it's, it's, it's just red flag. Getting lost inside crazy ass freaking hospital. Hospital of death. That's what I'm gonna say. Hospital of death. Where's all the tape? I'm just finding. Can I get some tape, please? Cousin is gonna be on one of the other floors. Or I'm like, no. Later. A little nervous. Go upstairs. Aha. Uh -huh. And oh, it's just batteries again. Nope. Nope. I want no toilet monster jumping out on me. Nope, no, no, no want no crazy nurse. Danger music. Danger! Danger, Will Robinson! Danger! Oh, sh oh, oh. Uh, you got a little schmutz on your uh, uniform. You might want to go home and take care of that. I heard that hydrogen peroxide takes out blood off of clothes if you soak it in. All right, let's just walk normal. Kind of be a little. So she's to my right. Oh, she opens doors. Okay, good to know. Crazy zombie nurse can come out and get you. Hopefully she doesn't open the door. Then like, if, if you're hiding and she sees that you're hiding in one of these like lockers, can you come in and get you. Imagine. Oh. Yep. 
Yeah, let's just do this. I can hear the danger. All right, there, now it's going to... Coming, she's walking down this way. Should see her any minute now. And... Uh... Psycho. <laughs> John, John, I want to go down that way. Camping all the spots and I need to find tape. All right. <whistles> Made it. We're going to just be hopping through wall locker to wall locker. You're not getting me. I've learned my lessons off of previous games. I'm pretty good at hiding. Yeah, you don't know where I'm at. No, don't even fake like you do. You don't. You don't even know. All right. <laughs> Can't get me. Psycho looking. Well, you, you look like you have like a bone sticking out of your shoulder. <clears throat> All right. Very, very quietly walking down. All right. I don't hear the music anymore. We need to get back down. Either we need to go around, or we need to go down, because we didn't check the first floor. We kind of went around the basement. We didn't really go this side, did we? Weird. That's the stairs. Okay, we did kind of go on this side already. All right, let's go down. And... Okay, we are down. All right, next floor. Should be first floor. I'm right there. Oh, the battery. Um, oh yeah, more tape. Okay, okay. All right, so as far as I know, she's upstairs. She'd be coming down from where I just came down. We don't want to be around when she does. That, ooh, it's... Can't I just take the matches and burn this place down? Would that put an end to all the evil? Storage room? Ooh, a radio. All right. Seven out of eight. One more. One more. Well. Oh, okay, here we go. Okay, got enough tape. Sure do. Now we have to get back to the generator. Sure do. Well, let's let's head right back to that generator. Hope everybody's doing good. I'm trying to play some like new games lately. Um, I'm not. I'm not. I'm not stopping uh, with Star Sand, but I have been kind of streaming it more than. Uh, I've been I've been streaming more Star Sand because at this point we are just collecting materials and trying to get uh, build our own little city, our own uh, little area that we are at. Oh, this is high for right now. So. I will be making more videos, but uh, I don't. I don't really think that you guys are really interested in watching me just farm and run around in the in the desert. But I do appreciate everybody coming by, checking out those videos, hanging out in my live streams. Uh, I have been trying to live stream more often. Um, I kind of enjoy it a little bit more because it gives me an opportunity to talk to everybody. 
Unlike this freaking, whoa, where's your nose? Crazy psycho, where's your, oh. Just gives you chills. Makes your freaking like cold all the way to the bone. All right, let's just leave. Where is the stairs? These are stairs? Yes. All right. Repair the generator in the basement. All right, we're down. We should be doing the same. Nothing. Well, it's a change. We should be going the same, relatively the same way we went before. Okay. Oh, sweet. Now let's fix this thing. It's fixed. Nice. It's running. Because I'm a. Now we'll have to look for a key to finally get out of this place. A key? Um. Guys, uh. All right. So we need to go back upstairs. Is it on this floor or is it up? It looks like it might be up top. Do I need the flashlight on at this point? Dude, we're so gonna die. Freaking crazy ass nurse is gonna come around and just kill us. Why am I holding it up? <gasps> Found it. Leave the building through the main end. You're gonna be. Uh. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Got it. Mm. Yeah. Sixteen minutes and fifty-two seconds. Oh. Okay, well, I didn't expect it to be ending right there. I thought I was halfway expecting it to be a little bit more. But yeah, uh, this is After Hours. Um, if you guys feel so inclined to want to spend a couple bucks and uh, play it, it's on Steam. Other than that, not too bad of a game. Kind of gives you a little bit of chills. Um... Reminds me of the old granny game of running around the house, but the granny game had like a more More things that you had to do to escape. This one was pretty much cut and dry I don't want to talk trash about it, but it, it can use a little bit more. I hope they don't give up on it It does probably have some potential for progression I like to see the, the good in a lot of things and I think this game could have some possibilities um, if the developer wants to continue to develop it but other than that, I appreciate you guys coming by, hanging out. Make sure that you leave a like, do all the things, subscribe, you know, all that stuff because it's free and it just helps me out. Appreciate you all. Hope you all have a great day and uh, we'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.